Okay, what is up, YouTube? This is the squad. God damn it, Grant. I already told you. They already know it's the freaking squad, man. Come on, man. Jeremiah, Jeremiah, calm down. We will get you a Snickers bar later, Jeremiah. Anyways, let's get started, boys. Let's get started with this. Jeremiah, sit down, Jeremiah. S Jeremiah, sit down. Okay, boys, here we go. Jeremiah's going to get a Snickers bar. Um, what are we going to do today? We are going to compare the Jeep, Land Rover, and Toyota 4Runner today. Am I an expert on this stuff? Hell no. Is any Would I consider anybody else an expert? Yes. I am the lowest of the low on knowing about this stuff. Why? You might ask, why are you recording a video on this crap then? And I'm like, I don't know, man. It looks fun. I'm just going to play it. That's the type of... That's 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 my thought on this. Okay, so it correct me if I I'm going to don't correct me. Actually correct me. Correct me. Yeah, correct me. Cuz I'm going to say a lot of crap went wrong and I'm probably not going to know too much, so I just want to I just want to test this out. What we're going to do is okay, let's look at here. We got the Jeep. Or actually I'll talk I'll talk about this as we get going. What car are we, uh, are we even in? And I'm not even good at spin tires, guys. I'll let you guys know that too. First one we're, we're going to take the Jeep out. All wheels on, diff lock on, I figure you want those on. Um, I'll try to work the manual gear shift. I've never drove a manual in my life. I don't really know how it operates. I kind of know how you want to stay in low gear when going through mud and stuff. But other than that, I really don't know what is going on. So, we're going to take the Jeep out. We're going to hit hammer the trails. We're going to tear some crap up, boys. Look, she looks good. She looks good going down here. Oh, we got rocks already. And it just demolishes the freaking rocks. Goes over that. She's climbing. She's climbing. She's doing good. She's got a lot of power, though. A lot of power. There we go. I don't know. Should I see how fast I can get through these trails? Or well, I don't know. What, what, I've never even rode these tra drove these trails. So I don't know. But we'll figure it out. This is the hill map. Which is not a modded map. It's just it's you start with it. Ooh, I, I like it. I like the Jeep and how... Okay, I'm, guys, guys, hear me out. I'm used to playing farm similar, so I'm not really used to that type of, like, mud and stuff all over the Jeep and how dirty it is. So I really like that style. It has. Holy crap, where are we going? This is just like a muddy, slidey hill. I should just be able to slide right down this. The Jeep, uh, the Jeep does well. Okay, and you look at price difference. We got the Land Rover... We got the 4Runner, and we got the Jeep. I'm going to say the cheapest off-road vehicle you can buy out of these three. It's probably going to definitely, definitely going to be the 4Runner, uh, I'd say. The Toyota 4Runner. My friend has one. It has 250,000 miles. It's still going strong. I'm still, I'm sure you guys have Jeeps and stuff, and that will uh, go over 300,000 miles and stuff. And um, Yeah, but this... The 4Runner is definitely the cheapest. Jeep is second most expensive in the land. Land Rover is definitely... Okay, hopefully we can get through this water. It's doing good, it's doing good. Make it, make it, can we make it? Oh, we made it. The Jeep's making it, okay. I don't know. The Jeep's just conquering this map. Look at it, it just goes through the ruts perfectly. I just try to... I, I'm trying to go side to side. And I'm try. Like, sometimes I try to get stuck in things just to make it interesting. And the Jeep won't get stuck. It just... Oh wait, right when I say that, I almost get stuck. Oh god, oh god. Oh, we're good, we're good. Where does this map go? I'm off the trail, guys. I should have turned the right back there. Oh, oh, the Jeep's doing it. Oh, one of the lights are covered up with mud. That's cool. That is cool. It's been... Okay, guys. They need to make another off-roading game. Like, Spin Tires is great and stuff. And I tried to make off-roading on FS15, but they need to make, like, another type of Spin Tires. Like, another new version of Spin Tires needs to come out. Okay, am I supposed to go? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, there it is. Oh, is this the hill? Is this the hill? Oh, the Jeep. It gets over those rocks really good, actually. Suspension on the Jeep's great. And we're going to go up the hill. 
Come on, Jeep. You can do it. You can do it, boy. Gear one. Oh no, we don't want to go in gear two. We want to stay in gear one. I need to do that. There we go. Jeep, Jeep. There we go. The heap is doing it. I call it the heap just because I had a kid in class who has a Jeep and he always called it the heap. I don't know why. I don't know why he called it the heap, but it's kind of funny, honestly. It's. It like wants to stall out and then it wants to go and then it wants to stall out and go. It's just this Jeep. Not his Jeep. This Jeep. Oh, uh, it's probably trying to shift a gear too. I should probably keep the throttle down a little bit. Gear zero? We're in neutral? Oh, oh, I have the gear selector. Okay. That's why we're in gear zero. Because I had the gear selector. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. Okay, so it made it up the hill pretty far. We're going to pull off the road. Stop right here. And Jeep did well, guys. Jeep did well. We're going to switch cars. Land Rover. Ah. You know what? I should start with the cheapest and went to the most expensive, but we'll go to the Land Rover. Okay, and also, I didn't mention this, but we do have um, like all the accessories on. I, I was like either... Am I going to go stock or, or am I going to have all the accessories on? And I was like, you know what? It would look sick if we had all the accessories on and stuff. So we got the baddest of the baddest tires. We got what else? Yeah, that's what roof rack. Oh, my bad, dude. There we go. I have a feeling the Land Rover is not going to do as good, but prove me wrong, Land Rover. Prove me wrong. fourth gear already there we go it's it's climbing it's climbing I need a better view okay there we go it just goes over those rocks nice the ruts aren't too bad on this map actually on this trail the ruts aren't too bad this thing wants to just I give it throttle it just wants to keep going 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 it just pushes oh until we hit this mud hole I think the Jeep got through here a little better than the Land Rover. But the Land Rover's also, guys, you gotta remember, the Land Rover's also a ton of luxury. Like, I could... Okay, I, w I was about to say something so stupid. I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. It goes down the hill good. Can it go up the hill good is the question. Oh, she's a muddy one. She is muddy. Come on. Come on, Land Rover. Also, guys, I am downloading uh, GTA right now. In case you guys want, want to know, I am downloading GTA. Definitely going to hit. I would definitely recommend you guys to hit up some off-roading videos and toy hauling videos on GTA. It's going to be sick. It's an old game, I know. But I think, I think it'll be fun. I think it'll be fun to play. I hope you guys are going to watch that. Oh, it's doing it. Oh, okay. We got to go right this time. Oh, she's just so slow. Once it hits this mud, it's it's like bottoming out through here. It is bottoming out. It just doesn't have... Oh, I should probably put it in gear one. It just doesn't have much torque. No, I, oh. I always leave the gear selector on. I don't know why. Okay, here's the hill. Here's the hill challenge. Can it make it up? I think it probably can. It just doesn't have good power in the mud, but it's doing good on the just on the dry stuff. Yeah, look at this. Also, the Jeep. I think the Jeep did this too. I don't know. The Jeep got stuck up here, I remember. So, Land Rover... Oh, oh, she just has power. The Land Rover does a lot better with like power and stuff and just hitting the hill. Ooh, the Jeep did, I remember the Jeep did have a hard problem here, but I think I, I don't know, I lost the momentum on the Land Rover when I came up here, if you guys saw that. It, I think the Land Rover definitely did better on the hill. The Jeep, though, dominated the Land Rover in the mud, definitely. Parker here. Um, oh, let's go get the 4Runner. I'm, I'm curious to see how this 4Runner is going to do, because this is the, we'll see. <laughs> 
Ready, Forerunner? You, we gonna do this, boy? We are gonna do this. Here we go. Now, I think this is gonna be the lowest of the lowest power, I would guess. I would guess the Jeep would have more power than the Forerunner. I think this is 94 Forerunner. If I'm correct. It's doing it. Oh, it's a little squirrely, though. It's, hard. it's a little harder to control, but definitely... It's... Oh, who's calling me? Who is calling me on Skype at this? Oh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you for not... Uh, for exiting out of the call. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it just hits it. it this is kind of like the Land Rover. The Jeep went right through this, but the Land Rover... Land Rover uh, got stuck a little, too. I don't know. I think I think this thing's gonna ha have a hard time getting up the hill. I would guess it's getting through this stuff fine, I guess. But I just know that these forerunners won't have too much power. It's having a hard time getting down the hill. Jeez. It's but it's doing it. It's doing it. I need my to turn my wipers on. That's what I need to do. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. Come on. Oh, are we stuck here even? This is like, if you want an entry, uh, entry off road vehicle, this is definitely the vehicle to get a 4Runner because it's definitely the cheapest. Um, but maybe you can find some cheap Jeeps too. And a 4Runner. But a 4Runner, think about this. A 4Runner has a really reliable engine. That's uh, that's that's kind of being biased because the that's like the only off-roading vehicle here that I've ridden in is a Forerunner. It's making it up. There we go. Okay, now for the hill, Forerunner. Can you hear the hill? Oh, you gotta get through this first. Come on, come on. It's just spin, 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 spin. It is spin tires. It's doing the game, boy. That did not, I don't even know if that made sense. It sounded like it kind of made sense, but I don't know. Come on, keep going, keep going. There we go, okay. The hill, is it going to make it up? I have no freaking idea. I would doubt it. Come on. Oh, she put the hammer down when she got here, but here's the tough part. Here's the tough part where all the Land Rover and the Jeep was having a hard time. And it just walked right up it. Wow. That blows my mind. I did not think it was going to get up there. Wow. Okay, so in overall, I would say the Jeep wins definitely off-roading, mudding. Toyota will on the hill climb. Land Rover, as always, wins the luxury. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you guys want more Spin Tires videos. I'm loving making this. I'm enjoying the game. I'm learning new stuff about the game that I didn't already know. And yeah, I like it. I like it. I like Spin Tires, boys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Remember to subscribe. Thanks, guys.